The DJI Avota 3 is generating intense excitement in the drone world, and the conversation surrounding it extends far beyond FPV enthusiasts. Rumors suggest that DJI is not merely releasing another incremental update but aiming to fundamentally redefine what an FPV drone can achieve. From the speculated 1-inch CMOS sensor to top speeds reportedly reaching 140 km per hour, the Avota 3 appears engineered to impress both hobbyists and professional content creators alike. Adding to the intrigue is the uncertainty surrounding its availability in the United States, creating an unusual blend of technological anticipation and geopolitical discussion. Combined with leaks pointing to design refinements, smarter flight performance, and a premium price point, the Avota 3 could easily become DJI's most talked about release of the decade. To understand why the Avota 3 is attracting so much attention, it helps to revisit the legacy of the Avota series. The original Avota made a name for itself with a sinwoop style FPV design, balancing nimble agility with cinematic performance. It was not only for freestyle pilots tearing through warehouses or forests. It also appealed to content creators looking to capture immersive, stable footage without sacrificing visual quality. Its combination of resilience, speed, and cinematic capability made it a versatile tool that attracted a wide range of users, bridging the gap between hobbyist and professional FPV flying. The Avota 2, released in 2024, refined the formula further. It introduced improved stabilization, a better camera system, and incremental hardware enhancements. While these updates were appreciated, they mostly fell within the expected scope of a generational refresh. The Avota 3, however, seems poised to be a far more transformative release. DJI has a pattern of reserving its most significant technological leaps for later iterations, and early leaks suggest that this model could represent a professional-grade FPV platform. The rumors include larger camera modules, redesigned propellers, and upgraded transmission systems, all of which point to a drone that is being positioned to rival even custom-built FPV rigs in terms of performance and usability. Design changes on the Avota 3 are among the first things to catch the eye. While the drone retains the familiar ducted propeller silhouette that allows it to navigate tight spaces safely, several refinements indicate a more sophisticated and professional approach. The camera housing appears significantly larger, likely to accommodate the rumored 1-inch CMOS sensor. This upgrade is a considerable leap over the 1-1.3-inch sensor in the Avota 2 and could dramatically improve image quality, low-light performance, and dynamic range, bringing the drone's output closer to the standards of dedicated mirrorless cameras. The battery placement has also reportedly been relocated to the rear of the drone, improving weight distribution and allowing additional space for the expanded camera system. The previous model's bright orange bumpers have been replaced with a more subdued design, giving the Avota 3 a cleaner, more professional look. The propellers have also been redesigned, switching from three blades to a four-blade setup. This subtle adjustment promises both greater thrust and finer control, a combination that is crucial for pilots who need speed and precision in equal measure. Performance expectations for the Avota 3 are equally high. Reports indicate that the drone could reach speeds of up to 140 km per hour, putting it in the same league as custom FPV builds. Flight times are rumored to improve to 23 to 25 minutes per battery, which may seem modest compared to larger consumer drones like the Mavic series. But in the FPV world, every extra minute of flight time is invaluable for capturing cinematic shots or executing intricate maneuvers. Transmission upgrades are also anticipated, with the Avota 3 likely featuring DJI's O4 video transmission system. This technology can deliver low latency feeds up to 13 km under FCC regulations, enhancing immersion and reliability for pilots using DJI's new RC Motion 3 controller or Goggles 4, even in interference-prone environments. Software and stabilization improvements are also expected. Rocksteady 3.0 and Horizon Steady modes, already praised in previous models, are rumored to be refined further for sharper and more cinematic results. These upgrades, combined with the improved camera and hardware, suggest DJI is aiming for a drone that is capable of delivering professional-level footage without sacrificing ease of use. Camera capabilities are arguably the centerpiece of the Avota 3's appeal. The rumored 1-inch CMOS sensor is expected to support 4K video at up to 120 frames per second, a significant jump from the smaller sensor in the Avota 2. This improvement would allow for superior detail, dynamic range, and low-light performance, while also enabling smoother slow-motion sequences. For content creators, this translates to cleaner, more cinematic footage with greater flexibility in post-production color grading and editing. 
intelligence and automation are also likely to receive significant upgrades. Active Track 6.0, DJI's latest subject tracking system, may be integrated, allowing the drone to follow subjects with increased accuracy and responsiveness. Enhanced obstacle avoidance, improved return to home features, and potential AI-assisted editing capabilities in the DJI Fly app could further streamline the creative workflow. Quick Transfer, already popular among Mavic users, is expected to return, enabling faster file transfers to mobile devices, which is especially beneficial for creators who need to work quickly on location. Safety is another area of focus. Geofencing refinements, improved low-light obstacle detection, and smarter fail-safe routines are expected to make the Avota 3 more accessible to newcomers while remaining valuable to experienced pilots. These enhancements could reduce the risk of crashes and help pilots operate confidently in complex environments. Pricing rumors suggest that DJI is positioning the Avota 3 as a premium offering. The standalone drone is expected to retail between $549 and $649, while full combo packages, including additional batteries, goggles, and controllers, could range from $1,199 to $1,499. Some high-end bundles may even approach $1,800. This price increase over the Avota 2 is significant, but DJI appears confident that the hardware, camera, and performance improvements justify the cost. However, one of the most contentious aspects of the Avota 3's release is its potential availability in the United States. Over recent years, DJI has faced scrutiny from US lawmakers and regulators, with concerns over data security and the use of Chinese-made technology. Lobbying from domestic drone manufacturers has intensified the pressure, leaving uncertainty over whether the Avota 3 will be officially sold in the US, delayed, or blocked altogether. European and Asian markets are likely to receive a full rollout, but US consumers may have to rely on imports or third-party resellers, if at all. This political context adds an extra layer of intrigue to the Avota 3 story. Some drone enthusiasts argue that the restrictions are motivated more by economic protectionism than security concerns, given DJI's dominance in the global FPV market. The controversy surrounding US availability could shift the discussion from how well the drone performs to who is legally allowed to fly it. If the Avota 3 is successfully released worldwide, it could reassert DJI's dominance in the FPV market. If not, it will serve as a reminder that even groundbreaking technology is influenced by broader global forces. Regardless, the Avota 3 is shaping up to be a defining product in DJI's lineup, pushing the boundaries of FPV performance, cinematic video quality, and intelligent drone design while sparking debates that extend far beyond the tech community.